Welcome to our video on how to make money podcasting and monetization. If you're passionate about podcasting and want to turn it into a sustainable source of income, you've come to the right place. In this video, we'll walk you through various strategies and tips to monetize your podcast effectively. So let's dive in. Number 1 Sponsorships and Advertising One of the most common ways to monetize a podcast is by securing sponsorships or running advertisements. Once your podcast gains a significant audience, you can approach companies or use podcast advertising platforms to find potential sponsors. Advertisers typically pay based on the number of downloads, listens, or impressions your podcast receives. Build a strong audience. Sponsors are more likely to be interested in your podcast if you have a dedicated and engaged audience. Focus on producing high-quality content, promoting your podcast on various platforms, and engaging with your listeners through social media, email newsletters, or a website. Define your target audience. Understand your audience demographics, interests, and preferences. This information will help you approach potential sponsors that align with your audience's interests, making your pitch more compelling. Create a sponsorship pitch. Develop a sponsorship pitch that highlights the value and reach of your podcast. Include details about your audience size, demographics, engagement metrics, downloads, listens, social media followers, and any notable achievements or awards. Clearly articulate the benefits sponsors will receive by partnering with your podcast. Approach potential sponsors. Research companies that fit your podcast's niche and target audience. Look for brands that are already advertising in the podcasting space or have products slash services relevant to your content. Reach out to them with your sponsorship pitch, explaining how their brand can benefit from advertising on your podcast. Join podcast advertising networks. Consider joining podcast advertising networks like Midroll, Advertiscast, or Podcorn. These platforms connect podcasters with potential advertisers, making it easier to find sponsorship opportunities. These networks often handle the ad sales, insertion, and payment processes, streamlining the monetization process for you. Number 2 Affiliate Marketing You can promote products or services related to your podcast's niche and earn a commission for each sale or referral generated through your unique affiliate links. Choose products that align with your audience's interests and preferences. Many companies have affiliate programs that you can join, such as Amazon Associates. Find relevant affiliate programs. Identify affiliate programs that align with your podcast's niche and target audience. Look for companies or platforms that offer products or services related to your content. Explore affiliate networks like ShareASale, Commission Junction, or Amazon Associates to find suitable programs. Review and recommend products. Choose products or services that you genuinely believe in and that would benefit your audience. Create episodes or segments where you review or recommend these products, highlighting their features, benefits, and how they can solve specific problems or meet the needs of your listeners. Use unique affiliate links. Once you've joined an affiliate program, you receive unique affiliate links or promo codes to track referrals and sales generated through your podcast. Incorporate these links in your podcast episodes, show notes, or accompanying blog posts to drive traffic and conversions. Disclose affiliate relationships. Transparency is crucial when engaging in affiliate marketing. Clearly disclose your affiliate relationships to your audience before promoting any products. This builds trust with your listeners and ensures compliance with relevant advertising regulations. Provide value and context. Instead of just sharing affiliate links, focus on providing value and context to your audience. Explain why you recommend the product, how it has helped you, or how it aligns with the topics discussed on your podcast. Share personal stories or experiences to make the recommendation more authentic and relatable. Number 3 Crowdfunding Platforms like Patreon or Kickstarter allow you to receive financial support directly from your listeners. In exchange for regular contributions, you can offer exclusive content, early access to episodes, merchandise, or other perks to your supporters. Building a loyal community is crucial for successful crowdfunding. Choose a crowdfunding platform. Select a crowdfunding platform that aligns with your podcast's goals and audience. Popular platforms for creative projects include Patreon, Kickstarter, and Indiegogo. Each platform has its own features and fee structures, so research and compare them to find the best fit for your needs. Determine your funding model. Decide on the funding model that suits your podcast. There are generally two types, a membership slash subscriptions. Offer different membership tiers or subscription levels to your listeners. Each tier can provide exclusive benefits such as bonus content, early access to episodes, behind-the-scenes insights, merchandise, or access to a private community. B. One-time campaign. Launch a one-time crowdfunding campaign to raise funds for a specific project or goal, such as improving production quality, attending industry events, or launching a new podcast series. Define reward levels. 
Create compelling and attractive rewards for your supporters at different contribution levels. These rewards can include personalized shoutouts, signed merchandise, exclusive episodes, Q&A sessions, or even the opportunity to be a guest on your podcast. Make sure the rewards are valuable and resonate with your audience. Craft a compelling campaign. Develop a compelling crowdfunding campaign that effectively communicates your podcast's value and the impact of contributions. Use storytelling techniques to engage your audience, explain why your podcast is worth supporting, and clearly outline how the funds will be utilized. Number 4. Premium content or memberships. Offer additional exclusive content or bonus episodes to your listeners by setting up a paid membership model. Platforms like Supercast or Glow enable you to create subscription-based programs where subscribers pay a recurring fee to access premium content. Choose a membership platform. Select a platform that allows you to create a membership program and deliver exclusive content to your paying subscribers. Popular platforms for podcast memberships include Patreon, Glow, Supercast, or Memberful. Compare the features, pricing, and integrations of each platform to find the best fit for your podcast. Set subscription levels. Determine different subscription levels or tiers that offer varying benefits and access to your premium content. Each tier can provide different levels of exclusive content, perks, or experiences. Make sure the benefits of each tier are compelling enough to incentivize listeners to subscribe at higher levels. Promote the membership program. Clearly communicate the value of your premium content and membership program to your audience. Promote it on your podcast, website, social media channels, and other promotional avenues. Highlight the exclusive benefits and the unique value that subscribers will receive by joining. Deliver exclusive content. Consistently deliver high-quality exclusive content to your subscribers. Ensure that the premium content provides extra value and goes beyond what is available in your regular podcast episodes. Regularly engage with your members and gather feedback to improve the content and tailor it to their preferences. Provide a seamless user experience. Choose a membership platform that offers a seamless user experience for your subscribers. Ensure that the process of signing up, accessing premium content, and managing subscriptions is user-friendly and intuitive. Streamline the onboarding process to maximize conversion rates. Number 5. Live events and merchandise. Organize live events, workshops, or meetups related to your podcast topic. You can charge admission fees or sell merchandise like t-shirts, mugs, or stickers with your podcast's branding. This approach can deepen your connection with your audience and provide additional revenue streams. Develop a brand identity. Create a strong brand identity for your podcast that can be translated into merchandise. Consider your podcast's logo, tagline, colors, and overall aesthetic. Ensure that the merchandise aligns with your brand and appeals to your target audience. Choose merchandise items. Select merchandise items that resonate with your audience and align with your podcast theme. Common options include t-shirts, hoodies, hats, stickers, mugs, tote bags, or even specialized items like USB drives loaded with exclusive content. Consider the quality, design, and practicality of the merchandise to ensure it will be desirable to your listeners. Find a reliable supplier. Partner with a reputable supplier or printing service that can produce your merchandise with high quality and reliability. Research different printing options, pricing, and shipping capabilities. Consider factors like eco-friendly materials, ethical sourcing, and durability of the merchandise. Set up an online store. Create an online store or integrate a merchandise section into your existing website. Platforms like Shopify, BigCommerce, or WooCommerce offer easy-to-use solutions for setting up and managing an online store. Ensure that the store is user-friendly, displays product images and descriptions, and offers a secure payment process. Promote merchandise. Actively promote your merchandise through your podcast, social media channels, website, and email newsletter. Showcase the merchandise in engaging visuals or photos. Highlight the unique features, limited editions, or special offers to entice your listeners to make a purchase. Consider featuring listener testimonials or reviews to build trust and demonstrate the appeal of the merchandise. Thanks for watching.